Okay, we're so close. How to arrange your materials before class. So you wanna do this like the night before class so you don't have to stress out about it. You know, when you do it enough, it becomes like second nature. But in the beginning, it can be like, oh, what am I gonna do? So how to arrange your materials for your class. All right, so here's the deal. I want you to, here's kind of my setup, right? So what I remember your little chart and you've poured your paint beforehand. Acrylic, you need to pour probably an hour or something beforehand and um, it can get dry out so you can't pour it the night before. You really gotta pour your paint you know, right before. But there's also this magical little thing called a spritzer. So if it starts to get dry, you can literally just spritz it. My spritzer is not working right now. Why isn't my spritzer working? Da, 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 da. Spritzer, working? Yeah, it's working, ta-da. So you can spritz and that keeps it fresher for longer. Acrylic can dry out. So um, this is your setup right here. So you have your easel, right? My little doggy that I just painted, I'm so in love with him. He's just like my new studio mascot. And my one canvas, right? I've got my paper towels folded over into a square. So I like a double layer of paper towels. I should have my tripod right now. A double layer of paper towels folded, well, literally a double layer of paper towels folded over into a square because we want that absorbency, right? And then I've got my paint brushes, whether it's three, because you've got a simple, um, a simple paint kit, or if you have 10, because you have the platinum paint kit. Um, and I highly recommend two cups of water. Now I use this very dirty water cup that I have recycled probably four million times in my class. And the reason I use recycled um, plastic is because the plastic lasts forever, but I keep it really, really dirty because then I don't end up drinking it. It is so easy to put your paintbrush into your coffee mug, promise. So, um, so that is the setup, okay? So you've got my mascot, you've got the, um, oh, you can't see him, there he is. The mascot, you've got your easel, you've got your canvas, if I could find it, there it is, canvas. Paper towel, you got your paint brushes, your water, your paint, and don't forget a smock or a shirt, you know, that can get nice and dirty and painty. And I think that's it. And keep your paint handy because you may want to refill certain colors or something, but um, don't drop it on the floor like I did. That is how you set up your, your painting station before class. Do it before class. Don't wait until class. You'll get in trouble. The teacher will get mad at you. That's it.